Hello everyone, welcome to this video. Today we will create coloring book using ChatGPT, Midjourney and Kindle. If you are interested in, then stick around till the end and don't forget to like and subscribe. We will use ChatGPT for suggestions. Let's see. Let's ask some more details. So once we have the suggestion, let's go and start creating the images. So I have come to mid journey and going to give my prompt and create images based on that. So I have given my prompt. As you can see, my image is already ready. If it looks fine, we can upscale any, any one of this. So let upscale version 3. Once upscale image is ready, save it in a folder. Create all the images required for your book and save it in a folder. Next step is to find dimension of the book. So you can search about the book, open any one of this book. Once you open it, at the bottom of the screen here, you will find the dimensions of this book. Next step is to create the template for our book. So let's come to uh, Kindle calculator, cover calculator. Here we can select paperback, interior type as standard, paper type as white paper, page direction as left to right, uh, inches, and interior trim size. So we will be using our book as 8 uh, cross 10 inches. Total number of pages will be 32. After giving all this, you can calculate the dimension. It will give you all the details that you know what is the cover area, what is the safe area, bleed area, margins, and other details. So, we will download this template and use this. Next, we will be creating cover of the book. So, we have overall dimension given here. So, let's get back to Canva and start creating our book. So, in Canva, you can go to create a design. Here, you can click on custom size. And you can provide your dimensions here. So to create a book cover, we will be using a template which we have generated using Kindle. So let's set this as a background of the canvas. You can select this, reduce the transparency a little bit. So we have to keep our content within this red border so that it will not be trimmed. So this is the image I have created for my book cover. So let's set this. And you have to make sure that you are not covering this barcode area. So the book cover is finally ready and this is how it looks. So I have kept all the content within the red border and I have not placed anything in this area where the barcode will come. So you can save this and download this as a PDF. Next we will create inside of the book. So go to create design, select custom size and you can provide the value here and click on create new design. It will create a new canvas. Before we start our work, we need to make sure that we are using the background template which we will remove it later on but that is required so that we don't bleed out the content which will create an error while publishing the book. So let's go to upload section. You can use this template and set this as a boundary here. Hmm. So once we have this set, now we can start adding the images over here. So let's take one of the image from here and we always have to make sure that image resides within this red boundary. Once this is done, you can duplicate this. You can add another image here. And to remove this background, you can click on this, delete this background. 
So this way you can add all these required images by clicking on add pages and save it as a PDF. To publish your book, log in into Kindle, click on create, click on this create paperback, fill out all the required details. You can review your book, approve it, set the price required and Based on that, you can publish your book. If you found this tutorial helpful and informative, please give it a like and consider subscribing to my channel. If you have any suggestions, please leave a comment below. Thanks for watching.